Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to your daily dose. But most importantly, welcome to Animal Kingdom Lodge. It's staycation Sunday. Did you almost trip? Are you yes. okay? <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. Casey has never stayed here before. We've got one night, and guess what? What? Our room is ready. Isn't that exciting? It's only two o'clock, and we just got the text as soon as we drove to the parking lot. Let's go. Let's go. Welcome back to Staycation Sunday, everybody. We're gonna, I guess, head up to the room right away. So I have been here before, but I've just never stayed here. And this has been on my bucket list for Disney Resort. So I'm excited that we finally get to do it. And we got a cool room too. We do. Can't wait to show you guys. We have a Savannah room. Without further ado, let's get on up there. Totally surprised the room is ready this early, but I will take it. That is a magical moment in itself. Probably the earliest a deluxe room has been ready for us. Open. Open. <laughs> See, look, it's not open. <laughs> open. Hello. Open. <laughs> what the heck is going on? Open. Okay. <laughs> Wait, no for them. It's so funny. Look, they're doing some art right here. Oh, that's cool. They're doing engravings. It's on the floor. All right, we are room three, 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 three. Something we like that. We are room. Hold on. We are room three, three, one, seven, third floor. We're going to Kudu Trail Jumbo House. Kudu Trail Jumbo House. This is Jumbo House, everyone. By the way, we tried to get Club, but Club was sold out. So maybe we'll have to come back if you guys want to check us to check out Club level here at Animal Kingdom Lodge. We'll definitely do that, but it wasn't available. So we just got a regular room, but a Savannah room. We're just gonna have to probably go up to the third floor just to kind of roam. Trail. What if we're all the way back here? Look at that. It's possible. But all right, that's Kidani. Oh. Yeah, hey, this I, is us. I'm confused though, because why is it not? This is where we're going tonight. Chico. It's all the way over here. Yeah, we're right here right now. And okay. this is, it only goes this far, but it kind of like wraps. You see this? Yes. Boma where we're eating tomorrow as well. I've eaten Boma for dinner only, so I'm excited for about breakfast, and I'm never eaten at Chico. Nearby. by. I have eaten at Sonata, that's really good too. Let's go, let's go find the room, let's try it. The store's over there if you wanna check that out first. Yeah, let's, let's go here real quick. It's super dark in this lobby, but it's, it's awesome. It's one of the best themed resorts ever. What a shop. Now don't get this confused with Wilderness Lodge, everybody. There's Wilderness Lodge and then Animal Kingdom Lodge. This one is on the edge of Disney property, right by Animal Kingdom. It's actually a way bigger store than I remember it being. Real quick, comment down below if you guys have ever stayed here or if you guys have plans to stay here and also thumbs up the video while you guys are at it. Where did Casey go? Finding anything? No. I can't find the shirt. I thought they brought it back, but I might have missed it again. You should come back here and look for your little trinkets for your... It's like George. It does look like George. It's, it's big George and medium George. <laughs> cool. All right. To the room we go. Before, before we go, Casey found this. This is pretty adorable. Imagine, like, this next to a picture frame. Or they have, like... 45 bucks. It's really heavy. Yeah, well, like, Is this you know. Is actually something that they've carved? I think so. All oh, these are. It's cool. I mean, I would hope so, they right? They also have this little one here. 35. I'd rather get the bigger one, honestly. I think we should get it. Let's come back tonight and see. I, just, I think it would look nice. Or tomorrow. Yeah. Good, 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 good find. Always thinking about the apartment. I am. I'm always thinking about it. Even though we're on the third floor, we did just want to come on up just to be this high to get some cool shots. If you guys don't come here just to see the hotel, definitely put this on the list during Christmas because when they put a Christmas tree here, it is absolutely beautiful. And the Masai Bridge is a must to see up here on the fifth floor as well. I mean, look at that. Beautiful. And then we turn around in the main lobby. That's the club level up there, you see it? See with the TV? We gotta check that out. It was just sold out. One of these days we will. 
Now our room is supposedly a savanna room, and we're on the third floor, which is nice. So if drafts mm-hmm. are right by us, we'll be like right close to the action. That'd be really cool. So like that's a benefit of being on the third floor is you're like really close to the animals versus up high they're kind of you know far. Mm-hmm. But we'll we'll see what it is. We'll see what it is because we're gonna find out right now. And there wasn't a huge price difference between the savanna view and then just a standard room. So of course you have to upgrade to see all the animals. You gotta like, That's upgrade. what you gotta do when you come to Animal Kingdom Lodge. So you can try to pet the animals. You can't pet them. No. No. <laughs> he, d- he doesn't pet the animals. <laughs> we, we don't pet animals. But without further ado, let's let's go to our room. And then to the pool. There you go. These are DVC rooms. You can check them out. These are probably uh, one into two bedrooms. We saw a three bedroom here last year. Come on in. We gotta remember three for the lobby. Yes. One down below. Oh, Why is there a, it's interesting that there's a star at the one. Cool. Usually isn't the. Yeah, it's usually in the yeah, lobby, it is weird. it's the lobby that's the star. Interesting. Fun little fact, as I'm noticing, they actually still have the old style front desk here. Usually everywhere in Disney property, they have a little gap. This one goes the whole length. So maybe we'll see a refurb here relatively soon. I don't think I've ever ventured over here. There's a huge balcony. This is not our room, folks. It's actually in the lobby. Wow. No animals out at the moment. This is a public balcony. It's in like the left hand corner of the lobby. Nice. Where's all the animals? <laughs> Do you think it's too hot for them? It could be. It is hot. Yeah. I wonder if they're just like getting some shade somewhere. Oh, I see something over there. It's like in the middle. It's like a big cow. They actually tell you what it could be. Nothing is on here. This does not look like what I just saw. Definitely not an ostrich. <laughs> it's a cool little area. It's very pretty. Very themed. What are the pictures on the wall? These are photographs taken by Americans Martin and Oza Johnson during their pioneering photographic safaris 1920s. in the 1920s and 1930s. I love this one. How cute that is. Oh my gosh. All right, we think our room is this way. There's four different pathways that can be on this level. I believe we're way to, right over here. I've never seen that. Did you see that? Yeah, we're definitely this way. Oh, another cool area. You see that? Oh, there's rocking chairs. How cute. Look at this. Honestly, I think I'm going to say it. This is way more themed than the Wilderness Lodge. By far. Oh yeah. I mean, they even brought animals. <laughs> Wait, this is three, four. Aren't oh, we three, no. three? Are we the other one? Are we the other way? Do we even check those room numbers? We didn't even check them. We just assumed it was gonna be over here. Say it with me, everybody. The best part about your Disney vacation is finding your room for the first time. Except for when... You can't find you it. Find, yeah, you can't find it. We've tried three different hallways so far. It's I gotta be over here. It's gotta be the last it's one. It's gotta be this one. Let's try this for hopefully the last time. Three, three what? This is 3 2. <laughs> oh my gosh. I don't think it's down here. This is the right one after all. We just have to walk about 100 rooms. <laughs> we're all the way at the back. We'll probably be able to That's see Kadani. Really cool though. Yeah, we're I all like out of the that. way. I'd rather be further down than like close. Yeah. Oh yeah, the buffalo. This is buffalo, be buffalo. Cool. I feel like we're going to have a better animal. Oh, there's the big cow thing. What? There it is. I know it's not a cow, but there it is. Sorry, I'm so excited. I'm screaming. He was so, so loud. So loud. So loud I could barely hear. And we just spotted our first giraffe as well. What a great stay so far. Well, he's walking over to where the seating area is. Wait, wait they're all coming. They're all they're all migrating over here. Like as we left. <laughs> they're all coming. Yeah, they're way. all coming. <laughs> we're three three one seven. We're only at three 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 six. Three two three six. Three two three six. Oh my gosh. That wasn't that long. I that was perfect. Phone, oh my, yeah. My app isn't working right now. Let's see if I can do it with my phone case on. Yeah. Work. <gasps> First try. Wait, what is, is this oh. Door unlocked now. Oh my gosh, these rooms are nice actually. 
Animals? <gasps> Zebra! Hi! No way. And then we got buffalo over there. Casey! I'm coming. Look, they match ya. <gasps> Look at this. Wait, we could get giraffes. We could. Oh, we're not on the lowest balcony either. There's one more lower, you see that? I don't but think they're gonna be able to reach They can't there. come further than that because you can hear like there's an electric fence. You see those things? That's yeah. how they keep them where they want to on the ride. What a, what a view. Well, no, on the ride they don't have them like that because they can go into the... They have them in some places. Oh, okay. How relaxing, huh? So peaceful. Wait, do you guys see the room too? I couldn't, I couldn't resist showing this for you guys first. Usually you save this for last. I do, but... The animals, you gotta, you gotta be on their schedule. Yeah, right? Can't wait. Can't wait. So you see, I love my apartment, but Casey just said, you hear that? I said, what? I don't hear anything. She exactly. goes, exactly. There's, you hear nothing. You don't hear anything. It's so peaceful. I kind of feel like we're at Fort Wilderness, just like noise level. Oh, I just, I love this. This is so fun. Yeah, I'm so happy. I can't believe we're doing this. This has been on my wish list for so long. Years, literally years. It's incredible. Now we're here. We are. This room is awesome, everybody. Now they kind of went through a newly re-theming of these rooms. It lasted a long time. This is my first time actually seeing one in person and they are super nice. Let's, let's check it out. I just discovered a really cool feature about this room that not a lot of the rooms have. So this is how you control the lights. But it has well, this one's kind of messed up, yeah, but kind of is. Uh, I don't really know what that was supposed to say. But this turns that on up there oh. above the headboard. Then this is the sconces. Ooh, here. can we press that again? Press it again. Let's see the magic. Nice. Uh, then, what's the good night one? Do you see that? Well, that one's cool because then you have the ceiling, ceiling one, which you can also use that one over there. But then if you don't want to press all three buttons, you can just press good night and they all turn off. <laughs> oh, fun. Starting off over here is where we first enter. Obviously, it's a door. Let's let's close that. But here is the closet. I haven't even opened this, but obviously you can kind of tell they've got a nice theming to it. All the doors and drawers are slow co closing. Love that feature. That is a top-notch luxury feature in my opinion. What's in here? Oh, it's gonna be our safe. Is this a steamer? Oh, they have a steamer. Yeah. Nice. Casey, you want to take it away for the living room? Oh, sure. Well, first we have our Keurig over here. Look at this beautiful artwork in the back. It's so pretty. You have another light, very nice. You have all your K-cups here, your creamers. They've really fully loaded you. That, I feel like it's pretty rare. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. you get like four, that right? nice. You have a little mini fridge right here. Looks like the same on property everywhere. Mm-hmm. That one's not so slow closing, but then you have Two double beds. You have. I really like that light on the back. That is super cool. So pretty. These headboards, just really all the features, the artwork, it's all very themed. This artwork, look at that. Oh, that is so, so nice. Cool. It's not like a, just a basic Disney picture, it's art. No, no it's <laughs> so cool. I love it. Yeah. And they got room underneath the bed as mm -hmm. well. And I like these. These are nice. Really nice. Yeah, maybe I should get something like that in my room. Not gonna lie, when I walked in, I was like, that's pretty nice. <laughs> Let's see the slow closing feature. Oh yeah. Look at this. All of these drawers are slow closing. Ooh! We love to see that. We do. Pretty big TV. About a 50 inch TV there. Mm -hmm. Here's a nice little editing desk that I'm gonna be using. And it's not really a desk, it's just like a table. Nicely yeah. themed as well. And again, there's no carpet on the ground, but everything is, this is nice. So beautiful. Even the bathroom too. I was just about to say the bathroom is very nice as well. Let's I go like follow the shower you. Head. Let's the do shower it. Let's head. see it. I haven't seen it yet. Do you have this pocket door? I guess this one's not really a pocket one, but you have the full size mirror. Uh huh. And then here's the, I just saw the shower head. That is massive. There's two. There's what? One, there's the removable one and then the permanent one. Hakuna Matata. What a wonderful phrase. What a wonderful phrase. This is very nice, very nice. And then look at the shower. Look at the shower head, what? It's like Coronado's. I think that's exactly like Coronado's actually. Super nice room, was not expecting this at all. Cause I was telling Casey, I was like, don't, don't be blown away by this room because it, 
It is dated, but a little surprise here. Very nice. Very nice. I love it. I do too. It's so like warm and you know homey feeling too. I like the I kinda like the dark accents and features. Yes. Yes. It's very yes. nice. It I is love very it. Nice. I'm really happy. I'm so happy and thankful. This is a very nice room. Go ahead and uh, comment down below your guys' thoughts and opinions, but I am blown away. This is a very, very themed room for the standards of the re-theming of Disney rooms these days. It's totally decked out. I love it, and I can't get over a view. The book that they put in the room is different than any other Disney hotel book. We've got the Disney Conservation Fund. I'm assuming this is only here at the Animal Kingdom Lodge because they usually have the, the Disney 100th book. So that's a neat little touch. Holy cow, look how young Bob Iger was. Oh. Also just rediscovered how nice it is to have like a corner unit because you can come out here and then see the other Savannah, which is right over there. So it's kind of nice to have this end unit, more space and more ways to look at animals possibly. What's the game plan, Missy? research and I found out that you can actually order Sanaa to go and if you know anything about Sanaa they are known for their bread service and you can actually get it for mobile order so I think we should go get that and then I also kind of want some butter chicken. That's over at Kadani though so we're gonna I think we can walk on over to Kadani. Kadani is the DVC portion of this resort so we're gonna head on over there and pick it up and probably eat it over there too or bring it back here who knows and then we're gonna go to the pool drink and then dinner so let's go. Also, I figure since this resort is kind of different and very large, this is where we are. We're gonna have to walk all the way back to the hotel, go outside and then go on the path over to Kadani. You see how it's two basically separate resorts, all surrounding the Savannah though, which is pretty nice, pretty cool to say the least, but I've never done the walking path, so I might as well just walk on over there. We just spotted our first giraffe from our room. It's actually feet, oh, it's coming this way. He's eating, we're gonna go eat too. We're gonna head to the pool and um, there's a restaurant down there, it's a quick service. So we're not going to Sanaa because I missed the deadline. I didn't realize that you have to order by three o'clock and I went to order at 312. So unfortunately, not dining there, but we are gonna eat at the pool bar. My bad. Out we go, followed, we're following the cheetah girl. Cheetah girl, <laughs> cheetah sister. We're not in the room though. There we are. To the left. You know what we noticed? Well, I'm smelling a little bit now. This resort doesn't have much of a predominant smell like the others. Just a little bit, but not like, oh yeah, that's Animal Kingdom Lodge. This way, Casey. We gotta go through Boma and Jico, which we're dining tonight. Oh my gosh, I've never been to this bar. Can I get a drink here real quick? If it's open? It opens at four, but can we come back here like maybe after the pool? Yeah, I have never been to, it's called Victoria Falls. It's Wait, nice. So they have lounge seating too. They do. Let's come back up there. Food Probably, let's not order a lot. Or did you already order? I already ordered. Okay. Maybe, well we gotta starve because of Jico tonight. Yeah. Well, no, we have Jico wet. Like, 9.45, 9 true. It's very late. I know, it's that late. Yeah. Oh my goodness. We're gonna be dining at both of the dinner places here, um, and breakfast, because tomorrow's Boma, some of the best Disney breakfast, and then Jico here tonight. I've never been inside there. It's technically like a signature dining. It is quite expensive. They're like 65 for entrees. 30. We'll check that out tonight. That doesn't count because that's, the, that's uh, the other place. Oh, yeah, yeah. So we are technically eating everywhere at Animal Kingdom Lodge Jamba yeah. House. You can say we're here, let's go eat. This is where the pool is. It's so pretty, like look at this. That's Jico, it's huge. Yeah, I've never been back here. Really? So, yeah. There's more safaris over here we can check out. This is so nice. It's very, very, um, what's it called? It's immersive. It's an immersive hotel. Wait, did we get, oh, look at their breakfast. Their breakfast kind of looks good, whatever that is. But it looks traditional, because it's like a quick service. Yeah. 
pulled pork sandwich is what I got. What'd you get? I got the South African vegetable bowl. So it's this, but instead of the chicken and shrimp, it has um, like a vegetable stew. Okay. Yeah. Wait, did you see Something this? Something different. The Mara story. Ooh. Okay. So it's actually like a an actual place. The Mara River is the Southwest Highlands flow southward for about 160 kilometers. Wow, this is neat. It's nice. Hey, what? I believe the only other time I've been in this area was during COVID and this whole place wasn't even open. So we could just come on in here. We didn't have to like, we couldn't sit in here. Like it's a really nice, I'm telling you this, this hotel is just probably like the most themed hotel on property. It really is. It's so fun and immersive is for sure a good way to put this, this hotel is just incredible. Like just by this, you know, you don't see this anymore. This is Disney's treasure hotel. Do not touch it, Disney. Yes? I need to get coffee after after we eat. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Oh, it disappeared. We'll, we'll have to show you. I'm going to get a beer right now. We're going to get an IPA. Oh my gosh. They have High Life. Guys, this is so good. Please try it. Please try it. It's so good. Except it's 10 bucks. This is ridiculous. 10 bucks. He's like ready to. It's High Life. Oh, never mind. I thought that was like something. Specific. Ready to go cocktails? Yeah. They yeah. probably have those at the different resorts, but. They have High Life. Yeah, Come on, Hi, you know I love Highway. I know you do. You use a scan of the cafeteria in a way as well. It feels like a cafeteria, like just like a very old one that belongs in a zoo. They do not lack sitting out here. There is plenty of seating, sorry. Not sitting, but I wanna go over here. There's so much seating. There's like a little kitty section. I thought this was a hot tub, but it's a little kitty section. Perfect. What are your first overall thoughts? I, quite honest, I knew that they had a pool here, but I didn't know it was gonna be this big. This is actually a really nice area, and there is a ton of seating, so we're not gonna have to be fighting over chairs that are its spot. Are you gonna drink today, too? Yeah, I just didn't want a beer. I want, like, a mixed drink. Mixed drink. Also, Casey loves this thing. I already showed you guys, but... Okay. Did you get this off of Amazon? No, I actually got it from, uh, from Target. This is the... What's that brand? Hearth and Hand brand. So Joanna Gaines. Ah, uh, okay. You know her collection with Target. It's the new colors. Yeah, it looks My great. My first one, and I love it. I'm. I can't believe it took me this long. A highlight is a chugger, though. It's a chugger, even though it's an IPA. I'm telling you, it's so good. This is. Look at it. It even blends in with the resort. Look at this. Casey, look. It like perfectly matches every color behind me right now. It actually really does. You got the green and the orange. Here's our surroundings. I am telling you, this is honestly. I feel like I keep saying this, but this one, I don't remember it just like, just being so inclusive compared to the other ones. And that's what I love about Staycation Sundays. We get to experience all of these resorts, but this one is blowing my mind out of the water with how themed it really is. I feel like this staycation is gonna be different because this is one of the most ultimate relaxing hotels on property. At least I've treated that way in the past. I remember in Jojo and I, Jojo and I we were just in the pool drinking all day. It's gonna be another one like that because we don't have dinner until tonight. So we're just gonna relax and vibe it out. Food has arrived. Here, look at my pork sandwich with fries. Looks like regular Disney fries. I am missing those waffle fries though. Like, I feel like these are the fries you find everywhere on property. They're good though. This is the vegetable bowl. It has some vegetable stew over here, this kale salad, and then some rice with, uh, this is, a little sauce and then some dried fruits. Looks like Chipotle. Yeah, but but better probably. Watch this. That's not me. Really juicy pulled pork. Way better than I thought it was gonna be. I am actually so impressed with this. This has so much flavor. I feel like it tastes like it comes from like Boma or Sanong. The rice is really good, the sauce is really good, and it all just pairs really nicely together. It's like a flavor explosion. Guys, isn't she so pretty? Stop. Love you. Love you too. Mm. Let's go to the pool. Well, the I bar first. All over myself. Did you really? Now, this pool is more of a, you know, 
a, a chill pool in a way. It's still so beautiful. It's a really small slide. I believe you have to go to Kadani to get a bigger slide. But we're definitely gonna get some drinks and just vibe. That's the plan of this pool. This is actually a dead end, but I just wanna show you this. Oh, it is nice. That's Jiko. See what I mean, how it's just so beautifully themed? Absolutely stunning. It really is. This is the slide. It's, it's a dinky little baby slide. Also, the hot tub is to my right. People are actually in it. Wowzers. Oh, during COVID, this playground was closed, so that's why I thought it was a dead end. Yeah, there's a nice playground right here. I think the flamingos are over here. Flamingos have a distinct smell. Yeah, they there they do. are. They really do. When I stepped on those stairs, I could instantly smell it. And flamingo, flamingos, you smell like skunks. Because they eat shrimp. <laughs> and shrimp is good for you. Shrimp smells bad. Here's a really good view of the pool. This is unbelievable. Come here for the vibes, y'all. Isn't that gorgeous? I know. I know, it really is right now. What a view. <laughs> flamingos. The good old flamingos. We gotta get the Red Queen to play some, some golf with the flamingos. Or how about this shot? This is beautiful as well. We get a close up of the pool. Like I like how you have the hotel in the background. Okay. Now it's time to get a drink to the barbecue. Oh, I'm gonna grab us towels real quick. Towels. <laughs> Here's a look at the menu. Banana cabana, that's never a bad one to get. Mango rum. I know you won't go for that, Casey. You know what? Screw it. Let's get a blue long blueberry long island. Heck no, let's get a long island. I'm gonna get a Long Island. That's a Kyle drink. Sounds like it. Somehow we got lucky and actually got a spot right by the pool. I mean, there's stuff here, but nothing personal. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it. You know, there's just extra towels. All right, babe. Cheers. Staycation Sunday. We love it. Favorite day of the week. This is bad. I don't taste any alcohol in here. Now, Casey got the specialty drink. How was the mule? If you like mules, you're gonna like this one. I'd say it tastes like a pretty standard mule. Um, there are a few other flavors in there that I'm picking up though. Shrimp? Not shrimp. <laughs> you're not turning pink. It's oh, flamingo after all. I gotta be real with you guys. Having this Long Island, might, some of you guys might be able to finish my sentence, but having this Long Island, is making me really miss cruising. And I know I just had a video where I was like talking about not Disney vlogging again. I'm obviously gonna Disney vlog. I'm gonna have probably five Disney vlogs every week. But we haven't been on a cruise in a while since Casey and I's last cruise out of Tampa. I, I wanna get on a cruise before the end of the year. I mean, we have some major cruises lined up next year. I already have three of them. I, mean, I think maybe four at this moment, but I'm trying my best to, to get on probably like a solo cruise this year. Sorry, Casey, I do without you. You just won't get enough time off. Put in those two weeks. No comment at this time. We've relocated. We're going in the pool. I can smell the flamingos from here. Can you smell it? Yeah, I can. It's your drink. We also moved our dinner plans up to 7.55 instead of 9.15. So we're uh, feeling good about ourselves. We're feeling mighty good. Sometimes easier to modify on the day of versus days before. Three, four, Claire, four, I declare thumb one. <laughs> it's literally downpouring right now. <laughs> what the heck? Just that, just that one rain cloud. Literally, that's it. Yeah, we're, we're, we're gonna find rainbows later. <laughs> yeah, <we are. laughs> it's so funny. We're waiting for the rain to stop to go into water. Sense. We don't want to get Casey's makeup all messed up, so. Or my hair. Or her hair. It's still I raining. If we do it for tonight, that would be so nice. So nice. So nice. But if I have to, I'm not. I'm not to take a video. I don't think I'm going to film in the pool. Let's just go enjoy it. Should we just go in now? Might as well. I just want to finish this video. Well, do you want your hair wet? I don't care. You don't care? I'll just redo it. 
Okay. We had a good, a good swim, but we both got to pee. Are you really saying that? Yeah. Aye, aye, aye. It was a powerful swim. We got, we got to see a search and rescue, guys. That was really cool. They dropped the bag and the guy jumped in and yeah. he, he rescued the bag. He good job. Can we get a thumbs up the video for the likes, for them saving the bag? It was awesome. It's quite good. Hopefully like Gigo dinner tonight. Oh, it's gonna be good. We forgot about Vic Victoria Falls here. I guess we're gonna have to come back a different day. Okay, well, that'd be a good day night. That'd be a good day night. Ooh, my pants are so cold right now because they're so wet and the AC is hitting. It's, yeah. So if you know, you know. Whew. Welcome to the room, your royal highness. Thank you so much. The wildebeest have migrated over here. Oh, and this goat looking thing. That's cool. They look like goats. No, not goats. They look like donkeys. And now they're all practically right in front of us. It's our own safari. Speaking of safaris, do you guys know you can do like a safari here? It's like $80 per, per person at 8 o'clock. I had no idea. We're going to do that sometime. It's full. I almost tried booking it, but it's over at Kadani. But I think that's cool. Let me know if we should do that. Got all the animals out here. It's very peaceful besides the plane flying over right now. Where? Oh. Here's our outfits. Got my uh, Alan Emmons on. You know, just a Kyle outfit. But Casey, Casey got that Gucci on. Woo! <laughs> come, come. Uh, you know, when we dine at Jico, it's a perfect occasion, am I right? Miss Gucci? She only makes an appearance every once in a while. But I got my, this is a Zara dress, and then my favorite sandals I always wear from Target. And that's it. Apparently I'm too far to check in. Check out the sunset. Hold on. Let me adjust these settings real quick. Look at this bad boy. Safari sunset. Do you know how to win? Well, you started, so. Of I just you're won. Win. Well, of course you're going to win because you started. <laughs> First time uh, stepping on into a Jiko here. Very quiet, an intimate experience. Wow, the loudest, largest South African wine outside of Africa. Oh, nice. Wow, oh, dark, darker than I thought. So, Jiko is Swahili for the cooking place. And uh, here's a look at our view. We actually got a nice view of the little pond that we kind of walked by and then for the prepare of food. I'm just looking. I'm just looking at the wines here. I gotta bring back that series when we try expensive wines at Walt Disney World. Like, look at this: nine hundred and twenty dollars for a bottle. This is honestly one of the most quiet Disney restaurants we've eaten at. I was comparing it to California Grill, and I feel like this one's even quieter than there. I'm gonna do something a little bit different. I think I'm gonna go for the cocoa crusted venison loin, which is deer meat, if that's what it actually is. I've never had deer meat before, believe it or not, being from Wisconsin. And we're both gonna get some appetizers as well, obviously. Believe it or not, guys, being from Wisconsin, I've never had venison before, so we're gonna see if I like it or not. Apparently it has like a very gamey flavor. Wild meat. I'm really excited for you to try it. Same, I also got mac and cheese. If I don't like it, I got mac and cheese. Our bread has arrived. I forgot what this one's called, but this is giraffe bread. When it bakes, it gets that crackle right there, and that's what it gets its name from. This then one, we got butter. This one right here is an Egyptian bread, and it has a touch of saffron. I just don't remember what it was called. It's very orange in here, but I really love the, how this bread feels. How come nobody talks about this bread on Disney property? It's nummy bread. There's butter, too. Wow. Good bread, baby. I got a corn salad with tomatoes, and they, I've never seen this before. I've got water that tomato is water. tomato water that's pairing with this. Interesting. I've never seen that before. See it? Kind of looks like a haunted mansion glass in a way. But there's that. And Casey, what'd you get? I got the Jico salad. It's red quinoa with lettuce. There's a, I think it's a lemon ginger vinaigrette, and then some good. other. There's some pomegranate seeds in here. Looks super good. Let me just say, if you love tomatoes, this is definitely for you. My sister is probably so jealous right now. It's very interesting. I'm gonna eat it all. It's got this very, 
it's, I don't know how to describe it. I've never had anything like it, especially paired with tomato water. This was incredible, unlike anything I've had on Disney property. Flavors were insane. I think Casey thinks the same. We just had our appetizers, but I'm truly still dreaming about the giraffe bread. It is the best best bread on property. You gotta try it. Here's a look at my venison. It has arrived. I never had it before, so we're gonna give it a go. But look at my mac and cheese. This is huge portion. Huge. Casey, what do we got? That looks beautiful. I got the chicken. It has rice and broccoli. It smells incredible. The spices on here, I can definitely smell them. And the presentation is incredible. Look really at that. Is. I also forgot what these are called, but I remember loving these. They're like... Cherries. No, oh my gosh, I'm blanking on the name. I'm kind of nervous to try this, but I don't think I'm gonna hate it. Also, preparing it medium looks medium rare. Very red. First time having a venison as a Wisconsinite. Very weird. Here we go. That is different. I like it. I don't really taste too much of a difference between that and steak. It's nummy. I can I, I taste a little bit of a difference, but it's nothing too major. Be like, oh, I'm never having this again. Comes with these nummy mushrooms too. Mm. You want to try some? This is good. Can't believe I've never had deer meat before. Deer meat confirmed. I like. How's yours? That's a popcorn. You have popcorn in yours? I'm not kidding. It's oh, popcorn. it actually is popcorn. <laughs> it's like one popcorn. Wow. Sprinkled. Look how red this is, guys. What I like about venison is. I haven't had a single fatty piece. I don't know if that's normal or not, but I'm here for it. This mac and cheese is unreal. <laughs> this place is not made by man. Wow, you're gonna love this. Go all the way to the bottom. Yeah. What in the world? Godly. The ones that are sold in the Alamola. The nest is made out of yellow dough. This dinner was crazy, y'all. Absolutely crazy. We got their signature dessert dish. What a staycation this has been. We're gonna wake up tomorrow and go to Boma. Probably wake up to some animals outside. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Do you have any thoughts? What a fun day it was. This really is a dream come true staying here. And that dinner was like a 15,000 out of 10. It was so good. Our server, Dawn, was amazing. Got to request her. Just to let you know, too, since it is signature, it does take a little bit longer. Usually yeah. an hour and a half, an hour and 45. It was we good, though. about, like, yeah, two hours. But yeah. it was nice. So Thanks. good. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.